No reason to wait around. There's... As I start, as I hit the button, fucking plane starts flying overhead. I'm losing my mind. We never have planes around here. I have my window open, because it's, it's hot in here. Okay, my lighting is fine. I'm... Lose my mind. Hello, Hysteria! Wow, you beat me to my own chat! God damn! I'm kind of embarrassed about that. I have to send a message that says test into the chat every time, because otherwise I don't actually get it to refresh. I have to ping it first. You fucking beat me to my own chat! That is so embarrassing for me. Um, anyways, I need to... I need to get a bunch of money, so we'll actually just be sitting in the Academy Asa tournament for a little bit. Um, Hysteria, did you... You have Pokemon, and Pokemon Home I might want. Because you were mad about planes. Yes, there's there are planes. There's not anymore, but there was a plane flying overhead. I have my win- I'm pointing to my window. You can't see it. I don't know why I'm pointing. But there was a plane that was flying overhead. Anyways, I should bring over uh, some more Pokemon into Scarlet and Violet, and I should move some old ones out. I never get stream notifications, so it's nice to be on time for a stream for once. Well, that's nice. That's kind of why it was originally requested of me to add the going live thing in Discord, because you can just export those. You can just export a single channel from a Discord server straight to a notification slot, right? Um, so that was part of it. And I found out that you can get more of the teacups to evolve Sinistra, so we'll be doing that today, too. Um, and all of these Pokemon are now raid Pokemon. Oh, I think I have these ready for me. Yeah, Ogre Austin, yep. There is... One of the extra Charmander. This is my Charmeleon. This is the one that I'm keeping. And then, what was I missing next? Was it Pokeball Vivion? No, it, it was Pokeball Vivion. Okay. So there's that. If you want a second player, I'll join. I want more emoji. That was like wings that only did one EV per. I thought it was that too. Is it not? Because that would be, that's fun. Um, i select a few more. I'm very sorry to all of these, but, uh, there we go. Oh, and also, um, well, if this wasn't obvious as to why this needs to go, I don't know what could possibly be that. Release these two. Yep. You only need 26 to max a stat? So they're vitamins? That's nuts, actually. So yes, here is the Hisuians that we're building up for things. And these are extras, so I can release them as well. Certainly release that. Select a few more. I don't know if I need that Zangoose, but I'll check. And the white one does a full reset? Yeah, I saw the fresh start mochi was cool as hell. I just need to verify. Zangoose. Perfect. We have it in there. So we can just release this Zangoose. Perfect. Reset Mochi. It's fresh start. Yeah, I remember that because I've I found a couple doing some Ogre Ousted off stream, but I haven't done much. This egg is for a single person in on our Reddit thread, and I... They said they were sick, so they weren't actually able to, like, get the egg, which I'm okay with. I hope they're doing better, but, um... Just sorting these out quick. Uh, Hysteria, did you... did you think of any that you actually wanted? 
What's in the egg? Oh, just a Zangus. There's nothing special. Um, but did you did you think of any of the the tradable things I have that you might have wanted? It, for in exchange for a Zara Aura, anything else? Because I have on my list of like things to do on a little notepad to get all the shiny paradoxes so that I can trade them to you in exchange for some stuff. Um, but a lot of what we're doing is just a bit of grinding today to prep for other stuff. But you mentioned that you might be willing to, to give me stuff in exchange. This is not like a streamer privilege thing. This is, this is a transaction. I do have a full set of Dream Ball, these things. Grim Snarl, I have everything else. Well, Nontaro into the box. I guess they're all the same. Yeah, I have three of them just because I, I did. Um, and then let's find that Go Celebi. There it is. And He Shells was my old account. Uh, you can see. Oh, wait. I guess I can't transfer that in yet. I also have the green monkey thing. <gasps> Sir, you have Zarud? <sighs> I do need a Zarud. Uh, but yes, it looks like I can't transfer Celebi into uh, Scarlet. So I'll find a way to get that one to you. But uh, at least for now, we will change this name. Just the basic one. That's cool. I'll change this box name to Hysteria. So that I know where these things are going. Go ahead and save change to the next one. Because um, one of the things that I need to do is get those paradoxes, which is part of why, if you look at the Discord... My go live notification was hunting for checks list like 20 Pokemon. There's a few. <laughs> I have a lot of things to get. I thought Celebi was in this game as a transfer Pokemon, but it doesn't look like it is, which is kind of crazy to me. <sighs> but anyways, I gotta find my pooch. I gotta get Paradox hunting. I gotta get a bunch of Ogre Ouston done. So we'll do that. Um, and we need to do a bunch of fights with a bunch of different trainers. Because something with the Kitakami Ogre Clan is, like, a thing. You can get rewards for it, so we'll go around and fight a bunch of them. Um, actually, you know what? We'll do that instead of doing the Academy Ace Tournament. Because as much as I need a shitload of money, I could at least do something interesting with it. If you have home on the mobile app, we can add each other and trade that way. I believe I do! I can figure out, like, a friend code or something. Hold on. Oh, I gotta fly back to Kitakami and spend money. Why do they let me fly between these places? I don't know. Weird quirk. Uh, so yes, I need to find a bunch of different trainers that are the Kitakami Ogre Clan. I'll do that first. Raids are great. Yeah, but technically the most efficient one by my calculations is the Academy Ace Tournament. It took a bit to get a Sylveon to grind it, but now I just spam the A button, and I'll buy a turbo controller this week so I don't even have to do it manually. I was pretty sure that there was like a little cave or something on this thing. Is that it? No, that's a seam between two rocks. Anyways, there's some stuff. Pick up shinies by water. All of them are stardust. Yeah, in Kitakami, I get a lot of stardust when I'm going around, so... Like, I've gotten that, too. I haven't gotten any Urba Mysticas, although I've done a bunch of these raids. I could have sworn there was a... Oh, maybe it's this. I think we found this when I was just playing through the game. And rare bones in the one dry area. Yeah. Yes, there is a person in here that is the Kitakami Ogre Clan. I think I'll just fight it with the Sylveon, because, like, I don't think I need to prove anything. Raikiri. The lightning I wield will shake you to your core. I'm not writing anything down for research purposes. Don't do this. I'm willing to bet they have only electric types. I'm not researching anything later. Right here. So, uh... Wow, that is a level 75 Raichu. I need to, uh, Terrasalize. 
Are you looking up what Raikiri means? I'm assuming it's a god from the land of Kitakami. That's my guess, because they specifically said lightning and not electric type moves. So that would be my guess, like some sort of god of lightning, but it'll only make sense. Was that a fucking shiny ghastly behind me? No. Okay. Um, anyways, it set up light screen, so it really fucked me over, but whatever. Ah, but it got the special attack drop. <laughs> yeah, you can do that all you want, buddy. I don't care. I'm assuming Raikiri is a god of some kind, or goddess, or something. Anyways, it'll probably do something stupid, so I'm just going to cheat and use a Paralyze Heal. Because I don't care anymore. <laughs> There's a Thunderbolt! That was a decent amount of damage, surprisingly. Don't be doing that! Okay, fine. I, I got lucky that time, that wasn't... That wasn't anything crazy. I want to go fight the rest of the Kitakami Ogre Clan to see if we can find out if we've got, you know, just like a pantheon going on, or if Raikiri is just the Japanese word for electricity or lightning or something. I guess I'll keep the current Pokemon, but I don't think I'm gonna one-shot this. So thanks. That's not happening, is it? <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Why did you make yourself grounded? Oh, you probably already were grounded. Um, I don't have Pixelate. And I do have Timpani. We have Brick Break, so we'll just swap into that. Raijin, the god of storms, and Kiri would probably be the action of pelting, so it's being pelted by thunder and lightning. God. There you go! Etymology. It's fun. Oh. Yeah, it's not gonna do too much, buddy. <laughs> Sorry. Oh no! My special defense! Uh, anyway, Sturdy's broken. Bye! So yeah, I'm gonna look around and find the rest of these things. Luxray? No, thank you. I don't care. That's fine. Pokemon Home is not loading for me. Do you remember where a couple are? Yeah, I'll just find them. There's only like seven, I think. That was like what the guy said. The guy who's gonna give me rewards for doing all this, I think. Um, I was pretty sure somebody told me that like, oh, there's there's like seven of us. Uh, how would I like to deal with that? It is slow. Maybe Meg Cargo is finally gonna be faster than something. Friends, had friend. Put it in my Discord. Oh no, an electric seed! Okay, it was actually an electric seed. Okay, I posted my Pokemon Home friend code into my Discord. Uh, yeah, we should just be able to use Flamethrower. Oh, you are faster, fuck me. Wow! You suck! Fuck your zap cannon. God damn. Some of the rewards are really good. I'm hoping. I hope it's money. I just need money. That's really it. Yeah, I really want Pixelate, but I haven't gotten an ability capsule. Or an ability patch. Patch is the one that switches them around. I have a free one sitting in sword, so I could just transfer this Sylveon back. Because that bug was fixed, so I don't have to deal with that anymore, but... Nah, you know. Also, I am just gonna skip out on getting a Mewtwo the Unrivaled. Because I don't care anymore. <laughs> okay, I mean, do you have anything else to say? I have no regrets. You should have regrets. You fought me, and you lost. 
fool that you are. Anyways, I don't really care about fighting any other trainers. It's not like I need experience. And they're all going to be wearing the Ogre Palon masks. God, I love how many items there are in this rock conversion. They're probably not all hidden in caves. I think I saw one in an open field. Well, hold on. Let's count how many weird places there are. Because this was Oni Mountain. So that was probably one. And there's probably two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight, nine ish. Nine ish, depending on how you want to count. Oh, do we still have a. Uh, do we still have Magikarp as the record holder for every single game on the Switch, along with uh, Golduck? Er, no. Golduck is in every game. And I think Magikarp is, I don't know, there's something special about Magikarp, but I don't remember what it is. That little hut! Yeah, they sell apples. I got a bunch of them. They're great. I don't like Illumis fluid. They're fireflies. You know it's just piss. If you're curious, yes, it's literally just piss. Uh, that doesn't have any increased herba drop rates. Although that is, like, the first five-star I've fucking seen, which is nuts. You're collecting piss? Yeah, that's... Fireflies do that by peeing. That is... That is pee. Real. Like, you, you can Google it and fact-check me. It's not, like... Okay, that is a simplification, but that is effectively what it is. That's not exactly what it is, but that's what it is. It's pee. I love that I can just basically break the fucking thing. You're also collecting Volbeat fluid as well. So you're collecting pee from two different animals. Because Pokemon don't excrete, their moves are their excretions. At least that's what it kind of seems like in the lore. Quit collecting bug juice. Oh, I loved bug juice when I was a kid. That brings back memories. It's like a little drink thing that they sold back in the Midwest. Maybe it's a national thing, I don't know. I haven't had one of those in ages. I'm gonna go into one of my nearest gas stations just like, Yo, y'all got bug juice? And they're gonna be so confused by me. Oh, there's probably a... Nope, okay. I know what bug juice is. Let's go! Any bug juice stands in the audience? I know I am. I mean, Kitakami's pretty fucking big. <laughs> it's not as big as Baldea, sure, but... Still pretty fucking big. I used to have it when I was a kid, too. Let's go! Bug juice stands. Oh, you know, there's probably one on top of these little, like, cliff island things. I bet there's gonna be about one per area. There's just an off-brand clone. I'm okay with that, though. You know, if there's an economic niche, it, I hope it gets filled, you know? It's, that's just, I'm just, that's what I'm about. If I want to purchase a product, I hope there's a product that can be purchased that fits those specifications I otherwise require. Oh, that's probably the Kitagami Overclan person. Hey, it is. Nice. I can't believe I got that right. Ba 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 da ba da ba ba. Hasebe is water. 
I'm gonna write that down. A C B Ladder. Polito Ed. Oh no, Dwizzle. I mean, Polito does have a decent amount of special bulk, so I am a little worried about it. Also, I want to find another one of the. the outfit things. You know what I'm talking about. I don't remember what they were called. Hey Lizzie, welcome back. My upstairs neighbor is making a lot of noise. You chill? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Can you hear that? Wait, no! Oh. I forgot Basket Legion's fucked up, actually. <laughs> uh, I don't think I have Poultry Guys or Sinistra on my team right now. So this, I forgot it's a heal. Okay. This could be bad. Although, we'll use Protect to stall out turn. Okay, so it's going for Shadow Ball, but I don't think I can protect myself from that, really. That is special versus Wave Crash's, wave crash's physical. And that's nice. And that should drop its speed by one. Maybe I'm faster? Oh, I should have protected because then I could stall out more of the rain, but... Excuse me! Hey, don't be confused! Nice! I never actually checked, so I didn't know if that was a real one. Anyways, it seems like my neighbor's not making noise anymore, so whatever. Ludicolo, will you switch? No, I think I'm gonna stay. Because I really well resist its stabs, but it probably has Ice Beam. Ah! Hold on. I'll protect quick just to stall out another turn of Swift Swim that it might have. And also, to see if it goes... Okay, well, it goes for Uproar. That's fine. Um... I'm gonna recycle quick. ba 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 da because now I get another Ayapapa Berry, and I can eat it again, I can protect, and then I can recycle again. <laughs> I can stall quite well, is my point. Well! Yeah, I can get a protect off, and then it's going for another uproar. I just don't want to leave the, the thing with... Hey, there we go. Okay. That Politoed probably had a, a Damp Rock. Oh, nice! It's going for Rain Dance! Okay, cool. Uh, with my Recycle here, I will now swap back into my Soundproof Pokemon, which can probably hit it with a couple of Brick Breaks or something. We do have to be a little careful, but I like being able to use... Use? I can't stop my voice from cracking, I'm sorry. Yeah, I've got soundproof, so I'm immune. Not bad. Also, yeah, Ludicolo definitely has uh, Swift Swim on there then, so that's great. Love that. Who else do we have against us? Dreadnought. I'm gonna stay in. 
Because I don't think Dreadnought gets Swift Swim. I say that... Okay, it doesn't. But I was like, I don't know for sure. Being named Boss of the Valley. Oh, is that Hasebe? That's kind of nuts. I mean, that does make sense, because, like, we're in... Oh, it just fucking used Shell Smash, didn't it? It did. I... I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Oh, well, it might try to set up Rain Dance again. We're good. I knew that was going to be close with my resistance, but... Okay, so there's Raikiri and Hasebe. Um, and that's like two-ish areas. That's like here and here. So I would guess that there's one up in the Timeless Woods. So let's go there. Oh, actually, I should probably uh, heal some Pokemon, huh? Uh, revives. Bingo. I have a hundred revives. Are you kidding me? Apparently they're pretty common. Oh, I'll just use auto heal, actually. Uh, I should probably have a sixth Pokemon on the team. Do, or, or, I mean, I'd really like to have Cheshire in some form, because I'd like to have the backup of that, but... Uh, oh, maybe we start leveling up Charmeleon. Check summary. Change nickname. Yes. Charmeleon's nickname is... Um... Megamon. And I cannot change it, so it's going to stay that dumb name forever. Haha. -ha. Can't stop me now. I mean, I certainly do want you learning Flamethrower. Do not need scary face. I got this during Community Day Classic earlier this month. About two weeks ago exactly, actually. That was fun. So now I have a really cool Charizard. Sadly, I am actually going to just switch it out, because now that I have the Charizard, um, I don't really care anymore. Uh, did I have, I don't know, something else from Kitakami I want to use? I mean, I guess, sure, we'll have another fire rock type on the team, and that won't be difficult at all to deal with. Um... So it never matters when we evolve, but I will evolve, because that's worth it to me. <laughs> I have like 11 Firestones. Okay. So the reason why I need this one evolved eventually is because we're probably going to meet Perrin next DLC. I mean, yeah, you should probably have E-Speed in all honesty. I don't know. Well, we'll see, because you'll get moves as time goes on. Apparently there was an item in there that I never had. <laughs> Don't know what it was. So yes, there's probably an Ogre Clan member. I'm going to actually look around these cliffs, because these look suspicious to me. Let's see who else we might have around here. So... That is like the entrance to the Timeless Woods. 
So there's probably going to be a person around here. But now I just need to find out where. I don't care about Toad School. Don't need to be in a wild outbreak of Toad School. But yes, uh, Hysteria, you had mentioned that, like, all of these are Stardust. And they are! Almost all of them are just Stardust. Or Barboach Slime. Which is great, because that's just fish mucus. Love that for me. Hey! Fuck off! My Terra Orb is charged. Oh, does it charge them when you go to raids? How did I never realize that? It's nuts. Okay, so it's probably inside of that, right? <laughs> if there is one here, which I would guess. Oh, fucking hilarious. Anyways, I can't believe that worked. Um, the, uh, oh, this was where I found... The first teacup, I remember that, like the masterpiece teacup. I found one of those here, but I don't see you exactly. It's just you. Um, I don't see anything else. Maybe there's something over by the gracious stones here. Wait, gracious stones. All right. So when's the shaman event coming? Who wants to take bets? I don't know how I didn't piece that together, but yeah, that's probably a shaman event spot. So that's cool. That's probably where you'll, where you'll find the Grisidiae. That is probably where you will find the Grisidiae. The Grisidiae flower? The flower. Because it's gracious, it's about gratitude, it's about grace, it's shaman. I'm Charlie Day with the mailroom signs behind me, just going fucking insane. Oh, there is this. This would be a great place to have. Wonder if anything will happen if you take one there. You can transfer Shaman in. You literally did, didn't you? I mean, I have a Shaman. But I, I would have. When I was transferring in the decks, I would have brought one in, yeah. Uh, but I don't see the Grisidiae in my, in my inventory. I went and bought all of the stuff from the, the fourth person in the Porto Marinada market. I can prove it. I have the, uh, I have the plates. There you go. Pixie plate. I got the pixie plate there. I got, uh, all the rest of the plates somewhere. There they are. I've got the rusted sword, the rusted shield. I've got the crystal globe core. I don't know where the other ones are. There's like a third or like a second set of those things. I must have passed them without realizing. There we go. Grizzius orb, adamant orb, lustrous orb. Um, I have them all. Did, uh, did Shaman get added as a transfer Pokemon in this update with the DLC? Because if that's the case, then I mean, yeah, we're probably getting an event with it, but. If that's not, then I don't know. I don't know what else. Hi, Jingmo. I like you. You're adorable. 
Maybe because you can get the flower at the port lol, I got one. Okay, that's probably it then. Then I just didn't... I never realized that you could transfer it in before then. So, that's my bad. I'll have to go do that, because I want every item. I have a thing for completionists of, like, item catalogs. And there's a lot more to get, but I wasn't, uh, that's just a freebie, you know? Like, getting that flower is easy. In the same way that I did not know that we were gonna get the scrolls, like the scroll of darkness and the scroll of waters, ever. Didn't expect that. I was just expecting Urshifu to stay. Same thing with Basket Legion. I never thought we'd see White Stripe Basculin again. I thought that would be transfer exclusive forever. Man, there are very few people around. <laughs> I, I am not seeing very many humans. We love having Dragon Dance. Yes, we do. Yeah, those are the Timeless Woods. I turned around. Okay. So I'm not crazy. I'm just gonna look it up. Okay, I don't know if he actually said anything about it, but I added you in home. Perfect, I'll uh, I'll take a look. I'm just gonna look up the Kita Kami Ogre Clan locations. Cause I am lazy. I won't look at the rewards. Um, there we go, I see a map. Okay, so there's one up in the Paradise Wilds, or Paradise Barrens. They're like in the middle of this rocks formation. Which maybe that was the one I was remembering earlier. We'll find out. Kanemitsu, the Merciless Sons, that's probably fire. Kanemitsu. Oh, they might give me their clothes. That's probably it, isn't it? Well, this is a problem. I do not have Pixelate, so Hyper Voice does not become a fairy move, sadly. But, it is strong. And if we see, like, a, like, Turtonator or something, we might get to have actual fun. Oh, that's not bad. No drawbacks, which is good. And now I can't be status by anything else, so I do like that. That's not too bad. Who's up next? Shift tree. That was gonna be fucking easy. Bye. Golden light. Oh, so it's not actually, uh, as it turns out, it's, it has dark types. Really? Because the first thing it had was, was nine tails. So my assumption was that it was just based on the sun, golden light being sun. Well, uh, there's the chandelier. I suppose the reason why Shiftry went first was it probably had uh, chlorophyll. Shiftry grows in the sun, yeah. Now was not the time for a crit, come on. 
Or things that emit light. Yeah, I mean, we got Chandelure, which very happy to see is back, but still. <sighs> God. Alright. Also, Hysteria, I guess we can trade now if you want to do that. I haven't opened up on my phone. We'll, I'll wait for you to see if that happens. Why do you get Psychic? Oh, you didn't kill me! I can't believe it almost. Yeah, level 76 is actually a pretty fucking high level. <laughs> Lilligant! Hopefully, Ariados, for once in its life, can actually be useful for anything other than looking like a funky little spider. Come on, buddy. I am begging you. Literally begging. I'm begging, begging you. Put out your loving hand now, baby. I don't know the words to that song. I just like it because it's funky. And also, I have a bass voice, so like those songs were great for me. Oh, my thing popped up. Uh, I need to look at box order. So if I go way down to the bottom, close to it anyways, shall be Go Celebi, somewhere probably right here, but it hasn't loaded yet. Trade. That is Pokemon Go Shiny Celebi. Um, yes. I think I saw that the other one was somewhere up here on Infernal Pass, so we'll just find it. And there's probably one right up here at the Crystal Pool, so that's cool. I'll look around. Also, I'm wondering if we can get some more information on why we have Terra Crystals here. Don't worry, I just keep looking down at my phone. Because we were told that they have a similar phenomenon, but we weren't exactly told why. Maybe in the Indigo Disc we'll learn that Terrapagos came here first. Uh. I mean, this is it, right? Like, very clearly. Oh my god! Oh, we're underneath the pool! This is probably exactly what I was looking for, actually. Okay, so yeah, a bunch of carbink, bunch of uh, glimora, probably some glimmets in there, too. And this probably leads down to... Oh, th well, there we go. There is one there. Um, okay, that wasn't the part of it. Glimmit, your cry is so weird, but you're kind of adorable, honestly. I don't get it. But maybe I'm not supposed to. Oh my god, fucking. I am literally getting boxed in because all these carbings are floating down to try to fight me. Okay. I gotta make sure that I heal. Or I am going to have a very bad time. Oh, I don't know why I don't just yet do that. Oh! A hat Pikachu! Hold on, that might actually be one that I already have. Is that Kalos hat? When I searched for them, they didn't pop up, that's fine. I just gotta remember which Pikachu hat that is. Pikachu and a cap, there we go. They're actually called Cap Pikachus, and I had forgotten. Uh, original cap. That is... Oh, is that Worlds? 
that might be partner. I think that's partner cap. So I'll look at my spreadsheet, because I think I do need partner cap. Anyways. I just always forget, that's why I make a spreadsheet. Uh, partner cap, I want that, okay. I need that one. There we go. Should should be completed in just a moment. Yes. Partner cap. One more. My collection grows ever further. Anyways, this is a fighting type person. I stopped looking at their name. Kotetsu. I'll write that down because I saw it. Kotetsu. Uh, and that was fighting. Nice. Thank you very much, Hysteria. It's a pleasure doing business with you. <laughs> One of my wonder trays just went through. Oh, nice. Anyways, now I can delete that from my list, because now I have it. I can keep that. So now I'm down to... What is that, 14? No, 15. I'm down to 15 that I need. And then I have a full living dex. We'll get there. Put a golden carp up for walking wake because I missed that event. Oh, fair. Okay, there we go. Kotetsu is done for. Now I just need iron leaves. I sadly do not have an extra one. I wouldn't put too much of your faith into it, Hysteria, because we'll probably have a way to get all of them on our files by the time the Indigo Disc comes out. Because it's probably going to act similarly to uh, Galarian Sloking. Which had a whole thing about it. In, uh, in Galar. You could only get... Where the fuck am I? What am I doing? I am so confused right now, but also so down. I mean, there's a Whisk Cache. A light source from nowhere. Um, I have like 20 shiny carp. Nice. Trade is open. Trade is open. Oh! Right, because you wanted Nontoro as well. I've got extra of those, so we can just do that through this. You are so smart. I did the... I really ought to have dyslexia, because then I could actually, like... Then I'll wait for the, uh... Paradoxes. Yes. We'll be doing that on stream, like, today, tomorrow, etc. Well, maybe not today, because it might not be easy to get them, but, you know. Am I going up? No, I am not. Oni's Ma. Where the hell am I now? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, what the hell? That's so cool, actually. I love that. That is wonderful. Let me find in my boxes down near the bottom. I have now to Rose. Trade. Okay. Uh, and then there was like another person that was like over. The yeah, it's probably close to that. Whatever, we'll go. Which hat do you want next? Uh, I mean, I would take, if you're willing to give up hats, I'll take hats, but in all honesty, the next thing I want is Zero Aura. I don't know if that's going to be worth the Shiny Grimmsnarl, though. It might, it probably isn't. Uh, but you could just send me a random cap. I think I only have Ash Hat. Or, uh, like, the original Kanto Hat. 
Because I think that was an event in Galar that I got. But I'm sure they'll be released again this time around, so I'm not really worried about getting those too fast. But I will take them, because it will save me tr trouble and I'll have more to get next time. Which is exactly what I want. So I have a Nontoro Grimmsnarl ready for you. And, uh... Yes, if you send me any of the ones, any of the hats, I'll be happy. But I guess, yes, I need Alola, Hoenn, Kalos, Sinnoh, Unova, and World. Those are the caps that I need. So any of those I would take. That seems like one of the hats I don't have. I think that's Hoenn cap or maybe Kalos hat. There's a lot of hats. Ash wore a lot of fucking hats, okay? You can forgive me for forgetting how many hats he wore. But yes. Probably gonna wait for Roaring Moon before I trade Zero Aura. That is reasonable. That is actually an equi like an almost equivalent trade. But that also means I uh I mean, for suspense's sake, I should obviously do the hunts in Pokedex order, right? Because, like, that's the fun way to do it. It's just to hunt for... I think Great Tusk is first. World Cap? Nice. I, I mean, I need them all, so I'm not... I, I'm not really worried about what they are, because I only want to look at them at the end. I want to have a full living dex. Of all forms, all everything. I think there was a guy. I could look at the thing. All of these are untouched. That's fine. I wouldn't mind if they were touched or anything like that or leveled at all. Hey, fuck off. You're not even your Alolan counterpart. You're not even cool. Stop it. Alolan Geodude slaps. Like, Rock Electric is a great type. And I'm glad that we have that as another option alongside Iron Thorns, but... Oh, would you please... App and mini maps locked. Let's go. I think it's over here. Let's go. There's partner caps. Through and through. So yes, I think what I'll do for hunting down the the Pokedex. Uh, yes, I do have Basque Legion. I think I've registered. Yeah, yeah, yeah both of them. Actually, I want to read their deck entries. Oh, right, because I brought up Shiny. Uh, and the souls of its comrade cloak its body and propel it effortlessly through even raging rapids. So, and it would be weird to keep just one, so I'll trade you the full set. The last cap could be something random. Oh, sure, yeah. I'll find something fun to remember the journey by. I will definitely get used to having the, uh, the mini-map locked north. That is nice. There they are. Yes. Perfect. Fight me! Who are you? I am Kitsu Kunitsuna. Kunitsuna. Ice. Kunitsuna. Ice, it seems. He says glacial strength. That is ice in terms of glaciers. Also, he's got a mass shift shirt, and I hate that. That is awful. I don't have my fucking Terra Orb charge. That's fine. We don't. We didn't need it anyways. So yes, I will make sure that I get all those paradox forms over the course of the next couple of days, or at least I should. Currently recovering my own iPhone XR. You have an iPhone XR? What the fuck is that? It's named after a legendary sword. The Kitsune? I don't. I don't. No, Kitsune is what Ninetales is based on. That's an Oni or a uh, Yokai. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of words. All right. Um. You don't know the XR? I'm gonna Google it now, because maybe I do, but I don't uh, remember what it is. iPhone XR 2018. Oh, that's iPhone 10. Is that what XR... Uh, yeah. 
12th generation of the iPhone, which I think is iPhone... Oh, iPhone X R. Roman numeral X pronounced as 10. Yeah, okay. I don't know what R stands for, but... Anyways, funky. No, that's Kitsune, not Kunitsuna. Oh, I thought they might be... I thought it might be, like, just a reference. X, S, there's 10, 10R, 10 10S, 10 and 10S Max. Love that. <laughs> Names. Phones are funky. Guess I can't complain too much. Because I've got a Motorola Moto G100. Like, if that's not so fucking absurd with how many syllables that is. Wow, you really immediately got the paralysis. <laughs> Fuck you. Don't be doing that. Oh wait, no, that's physical defense, I think. That's fine. No, don't be doing that with your snow cloak ability. Don't. Oh, I didn't even know there were friendship bonus in this <laughs> bonuses in this game. I don't know if I'd ever had those except for the final uh Koraidon and Miraidon matches, which are programmed to always do it. Why are you setting up Snowscape over and over again? Oh, maybe it sees only uh, neutral moves. Wow, you really fucking hate me right now, don't you, Frostlass? <laughs> or maybe it sees that Moonblast will be a one-hit, and so it's trying to ensure that it's got... It has a Focus Sash? What was it going for, Endeavor? No, it's still just going for snow skin. I was gonna say, maybe it saw that so it was trying to ensure that it had its evasion boosted? But I don't know why it would do that. That seems a little odd. Oh, Mammoth Swine's fucking great. Yeah, I gotta make sure that for the Indigo Disc, I have, like, an entire shitload of Pokemon at level 100. Because I think it's gonna have a major focus on battling. At least that's what we've seen. So it would be really advantageous to fuck with it, you know? So we have this one that was right below the Crystal Pool. And there's apparently one, like, here-ish. So we can go do that. And I found that one here. And there's apparently one, like, right at the bottom of this cliff, next to the person who talks to you about it all. How many have I done? One, two, three, f four, five? So I'm about to get six and seven, I think. And then we'll go get some rewards, which should be funky cool. I don't know what they are, but they should be funky cool. Yeah, the only legendary Japanese sword I know are the Muramasa and the Masamune. Which I think are two Japanese swords. The last three are the best. Well, I guess it's good that I'm doing all of them in a row because I want to have all the rewards. And I still need to find two fucking, uh, artisan Sinistra. Oh, it's right here. Yeah, it makes sense why I wouldn't have found you before. You're a little out of the way, aren't you? <laughs> Who are you? Mune Chika? Bow before the overwhelming might of raw strength. Probably normal, but I'll check. Mune Chika. If it's raw strength, I would guess... Normal. That is a normal type, so my theory is... Uh, at least indicated properly. Am I still paralysis? No, I don't have paralysis anymore. We're good. Oh no, not fa- Wow, that fucking fake out did a shitload of damage. Holy shit. Oh, because it's got technician. Hey, don't burn me. Okay. I was just like, wow, that fake out did so much damage. Yeah, it's stab boosted with technician. It's fine. Yes, it looks like that's normal. So that's fine. Ba -da -da. 
Oh no! Not cheek pouch greedent. Yeah, I know. That's so much. Don't, don't do it. God damn it. <laughs> Shouldn't have even said anything. All right, let's see, do I get to win? No. Don't, don't do it. Oh my God, uh, don't get, don't get paralyzed. Oh, holy shit, uh, what the fuck, how am I alive? <laughs> This is nuts. This is actually insane. Uh, Snorlax, will you switch? Yeah, I think I'm finally gonna switch out to the fighting type I have. <laughs> yes, so I have Raikiri, Hasebe, uh, Kanimitsu, Kotetsu, Kunitsuna, and Munechika. Those are all of the Ogre Clan members I've got. I am so sorry if I'm mispronouncing those names. I literally don't have a way to check yet. I think that those are their names, though. Oh no, not speed. Lowering and attack and defense rising. That's no good. I'm, you're not supposed to do that. What do you have? Leftovers? Fuck. Of course you have leftovers, just to make my life harder. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Oh, and the fucking... I just realized that the trainer guy who, like, told me to fight all the rest of the Ogre Clan members is probably going to fight me, too, so I need to be prepped for that as well. So there's probably gonna be, like, eight. I would expect a Snorlax to have nothing else. I don't know. Oh, that's a family of three, Mousehold. That's cute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten... Oh my god. I think it can go up to 20, can't it? I think that's crazy lucky of me. Or maybe it's like 8 to 10. I don't actually know how many hits it has. I just remember that it's broken as hell. Wow, that move. Yeah, I mean, population bomb is insane. <laughs> it's kind of nuts. Uh, okay, so it looks like the last one that we have to go down to is somewhere over here by Kitakami Hall. But, uh, yes, their, uh, their signature move of Population Bomb is a little nuts. Luckily, they don't have Tidy Up as a signature move anymore. Yeah, this guy was talking about the Kitakami Ogre Clan, but there was also supposedly something down here. Somewhere along here, there's supposed to be another person. Oh, there they are. Perfect. Just jump off the ledge. Yeah, you're right, in the bamboo. I was not looking at the chat, so I missed those. Who is the last person? Mazumune! Hey! I know that one! <laughs> That's a sword! Uh, my guess would be that they are ghost type, because the Masamune is like a cursed sword. The witching moves will leave you spellbound, so it could be any of like four or five types still. <laughs> uh, we've got... Fairy Dark. I think all of these people are named after swords at this point. Uh, I mean, I guess that's probably right. Because Ogre Pond itself has a cudgel. It's got like a little battering ram thing. I don't know what the word is. What's the other word for a cudgel? Mace? Mace is the word I'm thinking of. Guard of War, will you switch? Fucking yes, please. Uh, I don't know. I don't have like a ghost, ghost move. Marimba's my best choice because I don't. Well, actually, we'll just let Marimba die. The move is Ivy Cudgel, Poison or Steel. So it looks like this person's fairy. Because we've seen fairy, or we've seen fairy, fairy, dark, and psychic on the team roster.
Oh no, Marimba, you're terrible at your job! Who could have predicted? I did. When we started the DLC, I predicted that. I just like it. I just like Meg Cargo, okay? I am sure that you could make it work in, like, RU. Or, like, NU. Maybe it becomes a PU staple. Who knows? Anyways, it seems like we've got either Fairy, Dark, or Psychic. All three of those are equally likely. Ribombi! I think it's Fairy. I think it's fa face er, uh, safe enough to say Fairy. I would go for Moonblast or anything else. Oh no, Sticky Web! Bug Fairy? Yeah, I, I know I know what type Ribombi is, don't worry. There's only like a thousand and like seventeen Pokemon. I know them all. It's not hard to remember their types, but... Okay, Clefable's just pure fairy, so I'm pretty sure it's fairy. <laughs> that and every other person has had only fairy types. Same? Yeah. <laughs> I just like Pokemon, I don't know. Uh, is that... Citrus? I have Papa... Citrus. Yeah, can we not with the lag, please? <laughs> you guys, I had high hopes for you, Game Freak, that you might actually fix the crazy lag. You did great in Legends Arceus. There was very little lag in that game, and the times where there was lag... Like, it was not particularly crazy. Alright, alright. Let's see what rewards there are and if there is a final fight against the big guy here. I would guess that there's a big fight against the big guy, but we'll see. Hello! Heard you beat some members. Here's your cool prizes. As promised. A focus sash. Extra large candies. An assault vest. Rare candies. Choice specs. Ability capsules. Choice band. Was that it? Except for me. I think I can actually go all out. Ha! Yeah, okay, anyways. Thanks, buddy. One more reward. Yeah, I mean... Like, come on. I think it's gonna be the clothing, but we'll see. Yeah, just fight me, dude. I don't know who you are. More suited for battle. Come with me. I'm interested. What's your name, buddy? Muramasa. That's the other actual sword I know. Secret master of the Kitakami Ogre Clan. Now have at you! Yes, I think you might be right. They're all swords. Because <laughs> I know you've said that Kuritsuna is a sword. And I know Masamune and Murabasa are a sword. Um, well, I mean, Gengar sucks. So it's probably safe to just Moonblast. Oh, yes! Burn me! Hell yeah! No other status can be applied. Let's go. Raikiri is also a sword. There you go. That's uh, They're probably all swords. Kind of makes sense why Muramasa would be the last one, because I think that's supposed to be the crazy good one. I could only remember Masamune. Why does this smell like fire? My neighbors are grilling. It smells like smoke. It smells a lot like smoke. Jesus Christ, that scared the shit out of me.
Alright. I just googled it and yeah, they're all swords. Nice. That's good. <sighs> that was a little scare. <laughs> oh, goodness. Uh, no, I'm gonna try my best to not switch out. King Gambit. Terrible name. I, I hate your name. Bad name. Supreme Overlord, you didn't even use that as your last Pokemon. Ah, fuck me. <laughs> I was really hoping that would work. Uh, do I have a poison type on my team? I do! Okay, we have to switch in Xylophone first. That is just a thing we have to do. I'm not happy about it. But, um, it is unlikely that we will survive, so it's better if we just switch into Timpani. Oh no! Anyways. <laughs> it's not gonna be good enough. Sorry, Chopperberry didn't do much. But uh, good, good berry to have. Good berry to have. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Dusclops, will you switch? Don't think I have anything better than Dragon Claw, so... Maybe? <laughs> like, yeah, pressure's fine. You're not doing anything. Shadow Sneak? Oh no! Okay. I wonder if that's its best move. I hope it's not, but... I want a challenge! I don't. I lied. I'm lying. Shadow Ball. Pain Split. Motherfucker. God damn it. Okay, so we know it only has 140 HP. Or 141. One of the two. Don't do it again. Stop that. I don't like you. You suck. I I can outdamage you. I'm doing it very slowly. But it is happening. Stop doing that. Okay, you're at 67 or 68 HP. I'll get you one of these days. Stop that. You're not help. You're just gonna- you're trying to use Shadow Sneak. Alright, I win, but like, whatever. You're just trying to get me low enough to use Shadow Sneak on me. <laughs> Bastards. Trevenant, will you switch? Yeah, I mean, we got plenty of different fire types. Marimba's about to fucking die, guys. I'm sorry. Marimba does not get to live. I'm gonna try. I promise to I promise to you. I am going to shell smash right away, but I think we're gonna die. I am not faster. That is neutral, and it does some recoil. So that would break any That would break any focus sash you might have on there. My defenses fell, but I have my speed and my special attack boosted, which are the things that are actually important. Hit flamethrower. Hey! Marimba did a thing! Let's go! That crit might have mattered. I don't actually know. <laughs> There's no way of knowing. Okay. Rodont, will you switch? I do need to. Yeah. I'm kind of sad that they added two grass types into the uh, DLC and didn't really give... I mean, they gave us Poison Fairy, which I want to clear the record. I wrongly said Pheasantipity was the first Poison Fairy type. As it turns out, yep, I just forgot about Galarian Weezing. <laughs> I just forgot it existed. Hey, don't get doing that. That's not good. You should be slower. Or are you slower than me? No one likes Galarian Weezing. I'm a fan. Like, I kinda like it. JK, yeah, it's fine. I'm not- I'm never gonna be mad. Like, it's fine. Like, my favorite Pokemon, Puchaina, is a dumb little rat dog. 
that has no business doing this. And I know so much weird trivia about Puchaina. Like, I know it all. I am the Puchaina lore. I spent half of the stream running in circles. Fair. Thanks for taking part. Special campaign we run to train up the kiddos and let them experience the joys of battling. That's adorable. I love that. Oh my god, a free ability patch. Okay, well, I guess I have my perfect grinding Pokemon then. Uh, I am gonna save that though, because I really want to have one of everything in my thing. I told you it was good. Yeah, I mean, I like having those. I really want to have one in my bag, just to be able to have it. So I'm not going to use it, although I really want to. Oh, and I got a bunch of other weird stuff. I got some choice items I hadn't had before. I don't know why I hadn't found those yet. Choice specs and band, right? Those are the two? Yeah. I got like three from raids yesterday. God damn it. Why are you lucky? Anyways, that's just the first thing. That was that was the first thing on my list, if you're curious. The ogre clan is done. I need a lot of ogre ouston. But we've got other stuff to do too. Uh how much money do I have? 500k ish. I might be able to hit 700k. Hold on. I have great shiny luck too. Give <laughs> give me the luck. So yes, I should also write on my little list sandwiches. Sandwiches. Sell items is what I want. That puts me still pretty far beyond the 700k. I would get 60 pretty feathers from doing the thing I need to do, but that's not really enough. So, uh, the next thing that I figure that can get us good money is the Rich Idiots, which I think are at Fury Falls? Um, but they might not be. Uh, if you remember from when we did the stream a couple of days ago, there were some rich idiots we fought. They said they were going to waterfalls. Don't know where they are. Figured that would be fun to look around for, so I haven't looked that up either. Uh, the Kitakami Kami Ogre Clan, that would have taken me years to find where they went, so I'm glad that I didn't actually do that. <sighs> but there's so many waterfalls in this area. It could be there, it could be there. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. I've got an idea. I think they had a handler in here. They might give me a hint. Because they probably went to, like, Casaroya Falls or something. Two Houndour, two Cutie Fly, two Nose Pass, and a Sand Shrew. Ugh. Yeah, I think there was, like, a handler by this corner shed here. It's like this person, right? Yes. Waterfall in Area 2 of Paldea's North Province. Okay, where is Area 2 of the North Province? Area 1, Area 3, North Province, Area 2. Okay, so it's either, it's either Fury Falls or it's whatever this is. My first five minutes in Violet, I got a shiny carp. I am... I'm gonna get like 20 shiny Puchayana then, and I'm gonna trade them all out so that people could spread the word, the good word of the dog. I wish the shiny Puchayana got its blue eyes back. I hope that that was changed back in this game. If you don't know why I say back, in the original sprite in Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald, uh, and probably Fire Red and Leaf Green, but I don't know for certain. Oh, you're literally right here. Okay. Hi, dipshits. Um, Puchaina only had blue eyes. I think it looks better with just light blue eyes, but this 
is a current day accurate uh, pooch. This is one of those ten sites I've heard so much about. These are the Fury Falls. A bit more grandiose. Dullness notwithstanding. You're weird. Glitterati energy in the air as well. Your glitterati aura fills the air with a sense of rejuvenation. <laughs> I don't know what sound he's making. Isn't that our dear commoner, the one from before? I'm wearing a mask now. To give them fine items. 15 big pearls? That might be money! Someplace more remote. A place that is not famous or renowned or anything. It's by the border between the South Provinces Area 5 and Area 1. Okay, so it's probably an island. South Province A5, South Province A1. I do not know how much money Big Pearls sell for, but that might be enough to help me. Uh, South Province Area 5, South Province Area 1. Maybe it's you, or... It oh, Secluded Beach. Right. Someplace more remote, secluded, remote, synonyms. If I turn my camera, you'll see those idiots somewhere around here. Probably. Or not. Literally in the middle of the two. So it's the little thing. Oh, we could be on top of that mountain. On one of the ledges. Oh, okay. So yeah, I'll check the South Province side first. And then, once I get over to anywhere else, I'll check the the Area 5 province next. You know what I mean. We're currently on the Area 1 thing. So I'm willing to bet that's probably where it ends, but we'll see. Yeah, it might be on top of the little mountain, or maybe on the bridge. Because there is always the land bridge there. I think I'd be able to see him from this far away. Maybe. I hope that they give me... Or maybe this is like an infinite fetch quest where if you go find them... Oh, it's probably on one of those little terraces, you know? Wow, there's actually a lot of places they could be at. Let's check the land bridge. Maybe on one of these little ledges. Oh, they could totally be on top of that wall, too. The one with three trees to the southeast of the swirly one above the lake that looks like a quillfish tail. The one with three trees to the southeast of the swirly one. Oh, the swirly one to the southeast. There's one with three trees. And the one that looks like a quillfish's tail. I know what a quillfish's tail looks like. Let's just fly to here. Up a tiny. Okay. Uh, is it in the little marsh? Is that, is that what they are? Oh, am I stupid? 
Oh, I thought this was Area 5, and this whole thing was Area 1, but no, this cliff denotes the marking. So it's right next to me somewhere, probably. Ledge with three trees. Oh, I should be looking over. And you said above the swirly, which could be next to me here. They're around somewhere. We'll find them. They seem to be well hidden, though. Getting warmer? Oh, I'm sure. West of you now. Oh, is it on this little island? No, I see more trees here. I just went east. I, I said it before the chat message popped up. I want to be incredibly clear. I noticed. I realized. When I see blue, I think of West from an old video game I played ages ago. So it's one of these little ledges. Somewhere around here. Probably up behind me or something. One of these things. East? I thought you meant weast. Yeah. Since this is the border, I can just kind of be running around through here. And eventually I'll find the little sparkly dipshits. And that'll be fine. You said right about the spiral one. You might be talking... Like this. You are close. Uh, I mean, someplace remote. I love how someplace remote was literally next to my hometown. It's great. But you passed it. I passed it straight east from here. I, that message was probably sent a couple of seconds ago. So it's probably just on the bottom of this little space. Up that ledge, okay. around here. So maybe this? I'll find it eventually. Don't you worry. Maybe it's that. Like somewhere beneath these trees. Remember it's a ledge with three trees. You can see it now. Maybe that ledge up there. I want to check over here first, though. I thought for a second that they were inside that bush, but it was a Stantler. I was so worried. I was like, oh, if they were in a bush, no wonder I didn't see them. A ledge with three trees. I mean... If I look at my little mini-map, I don't see three trees on a ledge. Oh, but maybe it's a... It's probably a language thing. We might not define... Farther east. I mean, there are three trees there. I would not have described that as a ledge, though. So that might be where we're getting wrong. Maybe tucked behind this one. In behind the bushes. That's a le that's not a ledge, but it's also farther east. A ledge with three trees. Oh, they're here. What? 
so warm right now? I wasn't even close! <laughs> what the hell? Hold on, were you describing one of these lakes as looks like a quillfish's tail? Cause no. <laughs> I'll, I'll vehemently disagree with that. Yes, okay. We're gonna say, I'm, I'm gonna put that out to the jury, but I'm gonna say no for now. <laughs> Alright, talk to me. Maybe give me more money? Oh ho ho ho! Not a thing worth seeing. It's just what I've wanted. What is up with you two? Why, if it isn't hard, you're commoner! <laughs> Should have specified his Syrian quillfish tail. That would not have helped. <laughs> I wanted- I want to be clear just from my brain's perspective, that wouldn't have helped, but I appreciate the- I appreciate the sentiment. Nuggets! Your words are as pickaxe to rock, loosing nuggets of wisdom from common stone. For fruit, only the land of Kitakami can provide. Probably the syrupy apples. Or the apple in hills or whatever. Looks like a sideways pea. Do you not know that Hisurian Quillfish's tail looks like a Q for a good reason? It's a lowercase Q. Overquill's tail has a capital Q. Anyways. Aside from me being snarky, because I shouldn't be, that was mean. Um, yeah, it's a Q. Yeah, but, okay. <laughs> like, P for poison. No. <laughs> No. Oh, no, Hysteria, no. That's very, like, I mean, that is possible. I, like, nothing is impossible when it comes to Pokemon design. But, but no. Alright, is that enough to get me over the 700k mark? Woo, it is. Uh, if you're curious as to what the fuck I'm doing, I have to give a million goddamn dollars to some idiot up here? I'm joking. Okay. <laughs> I was like, please, don't do this to me. Uh, yeah, there's a dipshit who wants, like, a million poke. I don't know what he wants it for, but he wants it. How did you get 20k? I never gave you 20k. I never gave you that. 420. Um, I don't know how you got 20,000. Huh. Yeah, I, my assumption was that only I could give it to him, but I never gave him 20k, I don't think. Maybe I did. Maybe I just spammed A in front of him accidentally. That might be it. Or maybe over time he just raises more. Anyways, I'll give 100k. All this means is that now I'm gonna have to do a bunch in, uh, in tens. Big mustard vibes? You mean honey. Honey was the one who took all that, uh, all those watts from us. Mustard didn't have anything to do with it. Poor bastard. Getting the blame for that. Why are you trying to raise a million fucking poke? Actually, no, I wanna, I wanna see what happens if I try to give you 100k. Yes. I guess he's got a million in 20. Whatever. Oh my, we've reached our goal. Oh right, he wanted for Loyalty Plaza. Contractor. We were able to raise the funds. I don't know what this means for us, but hey, probably something. 
A million poke for whatever the fuck this was. Maybe it gives me a... Maybe it gives me a new fly location, 10 feet from the last one. Would you just look? Oh, it's the same three. Is it another vending machine? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, he just wanted it for the tourism, but whatever. F of all the Pokemon, yeah. Hooray, emote! Dude, no. Oh, a festival, Jinmai! I kind of like that. It should have been Ogre Pond. Yeah, absolutely, it should have been Ogre Pond. I was hoping that it was gonna be Ogre Pond. <gasps> no fucking way, look at that. That's so cool, though. That's actually kind of dope. Yeah, I didn't know that that was a thing. I really do need to go back and buy all of the, uh, teal and green. Yeah, exactly. I really need to go back and buy all of the stuff. That was a project I never finished in Sword and Shield. I wanted to buy all of the items, but I never did. What do those look like? Oh, they look bad. That's for sh that's for sure. Um, all of these are phone cases from the little festival. I kind of like the cream case. Now this is like that's a pretty baller Jinbai. Like look at that's that's kind of that's kind of baller. Not just the ugly green you get, but buy or choose between like ten different colors. I'm pretty sure you can. I don't remember how to do it, but I saw it in a video somewhere. I saw somebody wearing a different color, and I assume nobody's been able to mod that in yet. I haven't found it, but I saw somebody doing it. I think it was like Austin John Plays or something. I usually watch a lot of that because, well, he's good at his job. Fancy people? Fancy people! Hello! How, how many times do I have to find the fucking dumb fancy people? I called them rich idiots in my notes, but that's fair. Stop screaming. It is in fact a full orchard. Never seen one so humble. The ways of the commoners are shrouded in mystery. Such compelling creatures! Okay, I'm kind of enjoying the gimmick a little bit more. Talk to the grandma? I shall talk to the grandma. I wish to know more about you. Or you get the first gen buy? I will do that. Oh, sure, we can fight. Yeah, we can fight. I'll go back and get other gen buy. Yes! Uh, we'll crush you! I don't doubt that. I'm a little scared. Just a little. Just a little bit. But I want to try to get, like, basically a 100% file. I wore ugly green the whole DLC. I liked the green, but it is kind of ugly. I'm honestly upset no one told me about this sooner. I just saw that it existed. I didn't... Oh, right. She's only got a version. I totally forgot about that. <laughs> I was to I totally forgot about that. It's the worst shade of green. It's, a f it's like a forest green. They're delightful. Hell. No, I'll prove to you. I'll show you. Where are they? That's not them. Oh, where are you? Oh, where are you? And I'm so sorry. I disagree. I think forest green looks great to the point where I have a pair of boots that I custom made that are Forest green, holy blink 182. Yeah. Anyways, this is a this is a pair of boots I own. They're really cool. I've I've got a thing for boots. That's going to be stuck in my head all week now. 
Don't waste your time, I'm already. Uh, don't waste your time on me, I'm already the voice inside my head. <laughs> that's, that's it. Gumption. <laughs> Fuck, don't do that. Gumption, yes. It's gumption, but like, he said it kind of right, but as eye-catching as a pearl string. Biggest body of water in all of Paldea. Anyways, that's... Okay, so he says island shores, so we're probably gonna have to go to the center island in Castle Royal Lake. Uh, anyways. If we go to Masui Town, we can probably get more Jinbai. And that'll be fun. Hello, Grandma. Sure. Festival Jinbai. Oh, that was it? Okay, so there's probably only a few. You said white and blue, right? There's white and gray. That looks fine. Deep blue. Oh, that actually looks delightful. I really like that. I'm a sucker for that. Um, I kind of want to save the the flashy Jin Bai though. Oh, but I'm not really big into fancy. So yeah. Okay, there we go. Blue is my favorite color. Lol, I'm happy. That's good. I'll have to make sure I get another backpack or something, too. Anyways, I like that. Uh, so we gotta go to Castle Royal Lake. We gotta do a bunch of ogre ousting. I guess I should just do this first, because it's probably free. Also, I noticed this only when I was playing by myself after the stream, but when you're just flying between locations in Kitakami, the uh, the bird taxi, like the flying taxi, um, is actually a Noctowl instead of Corviknight or Squawkabilly. And I think that's delightful. So yeah, it's probably one of these islands, but we'll find out which one soon enough. I know it's adorable. Yeah, I think it was... I, th I thought that was very nice. I would love to see, like, if the Indigo Disc... I would love to see it just be, like, a Solosis. And, like, they're just... Like, the Solosis isn't actually anything other than just, like, a Pokemon strapped to the side. And the Solosis just all levitate together. I think it's the island to the left if you were going up from the south. So it's probably this. Or that. But we'll go there first. I just hope that it's like a bunch of Solosis, Solosis, or Duosian, or even a uh, the evolved form. I, I can't think of its name right now, I don't know why. Reuniclus, there it is. But yes, I hope that, uh, I hope that it's just like a bunch of Unovan Pokemon strapped to the side of a taxi cab. And they just literally teleport you wherever you're going. <laughs> I think that would be very funny. Oh, Nair, Billy. Oh, I hadn't had a life orb yet. What do you know? I certainly do need to go through the item decks of the entire game and get one of each item. I want to be able to have them all. So we're going to check this island next, because it's next on the list. Oh, or maybe it's one of the ones, like, at the entrance to the whole thing. That could be it, too. I'll go check them next.
Yeah, because there's like a little island that splits it in half up here. So it's probably that. What's gold? Oh, it was a Tatsugiri. I was just like, there aren't very many gold Pokemon in the water. Got a shiny Tatsugiri from a Tontozo outbreak. Nice. That's quite good. Because, yeah, like, I think one of these is an island between, like, two things. Oh, I'm on it. Or it could be that little one down there. I ran into it as I was catching a shiny Dundoza. Great. I had a I had a Sinistra outbreak, or no, a Poltergeist outbreak. Sorry, it's gonna be difficult for me. It's difficult for me because it's backwards. Anyways, um, I had a Poltergeist, Pol Geist. I am losing my mind. Uh, outbreak the other day, and I caught a bunch of them. And you saw me release them at the beginning of this stream, but. Uh, they were not artisan, they were all counterfeit. And I didn't actually remember at that time that, like, you only get one type per outbreak. So, like, if you wanted to shiny hunt for one, you would just have to, like, keep resetting your switch and moving it forward. So that you could... Oh, there they are. Okay. I knew it was going to be one of them. Southernmost island on the west. Okay, yeah, you you got it. You You were pointing me in the right direction. I just looked in the wrong place. Let's see. Look at this puddle. What's the difference between a lake and a pond, really? I know! Uh, it depends on uh, lexicon. I'm from Minnesota. If you look for the distinction, there really isn't one in terms of grammatical uh, stuff, but... Sure. Lofty mountain with pure white snow. Sure, dude. Whatever. Well, this one's an easy one. Probably, anyways. That's probably easy, but we'll find out. There is a little, like, stand platform around here. totally possible that they're just chilling down here as well. I can always look it up. Or I can just go check to see if uh, other lady has got my back. Assistant lady, please! Okay, so they are somewhere on Glossy Auto Mount. Whatever. 
I would like to do something fun. Eventually, we'll find out that, like, all they're gonna give us is an emote or something stupid like that. Well, there's some extra money. That's nice. Oh, I should buy clothing. Do I have all of them, or did I unlock anything else? I have all of those. I have all of those, so we're good. And I bought everything else up at the little, the little place. Uh, I think it's time we go ogre ousting. I, I've done a little bit of it off stream, but not a lot. Not a lot of it. I guess I should play alone to try to be normal mode. Because I didn't beat it last time because it was actually pretty difficult. But I don't know if there's, like, a reward at the end for beating the whole thing. Like, beating hard. But I did get rewards for beating easy. So I'm assuming there's something. And I would really like there to be something. We'll find out. 2422. Two. It's very nice. Good. I suppose that doesn't matter. I know that you can like move over to the next thing. I like the reward for normal. Well, that's what I'm hoping for. Apparently you can play it online too, so I might open that up if anybody wants to play. I remember Hysteria, I think you said something about it. Oof, I got one more than I needed on that. One of you, and then five of the blue, yes. I can join, I want Evo items. Yeah, so do I. And it's probably easier, but I should try to get uh, I should try to get hard mode unlocked at least before we start a little battle thing. But we'll see. How many do you want? Because I think the third is the last one that you can have all of them in your inventory at once. Eight, seven, seven, eight. Okay. It's basically impossible without more than one person. <laughs> Lovely, love to hear it. I know I was struggling and failed the last part last time, but I just thought that it might be because I was bad. Because that's more likely than they built it. Or at least in my mind, that's more likely than they built it poorly. But they also probably had it with the idea of getting it together in mind. Like WarioWare, get it together. Uh, yeah, I've got just enough for five reds. So there we go. Hard mode, I'm pretty sure, is impossible. Well, that's great to hear. I'm sure if we had a group of people together, we would just say split up and only grab one set of berries. Because, yeah, now I can't have all the berries in at once. So I would usually just get, like, if I could do the math, I would calculate how many I would actually need. But I didn't think of that. I would think, what's the minimum amount I can put into the ball, like, the, the, the bundles? I almost said balls. Haha, <laughs> balls. Um, what's the minimum amount I can put in there without it going completely mad and trying to, like, kill me? Hard mode, you need four people? And choosing berries actually makes you go slower. It's best to go random. Damn. I don't see a great ingredient. Oh, I see it. Fool. Three. 
Where is the munch? I don't see the munch. I don't see the munch. Anyways, we'll try to get some of these. In hard, you need like 50 of each color? Holy shit, that's nuts. Yeah, that would probably slow you down otherwise, wouldn't it? What the fuck? That is so fast! They weren't doing that fast last time! That's scary to me! No! I had everything I needed! Get the hell out of here. I can do it. I can't. Um. That's not the one I need. Yeah, I literally can't, but hey, it's fine. I think you still get some rewards for it all. Okay. I've seen a color in 67? Holy shit. <laughs> That's kind of nuts. Uh, yeah. Uh, wait, actually, I'm curious. Did we have the Jaboka and Kibia berries before? Because I don't think we did. I never had them in the main game. I wonder if they weren't in there. Because I know I got, or is it Kibia Key, key berries? Yeah, because they don't give me any other rewards other than that. I was hoping they would give you something funny. But it seems like no... Okay. Let's get connected to the internet. If anybody is in chat, now is the time to shine. Don't be doing that. I'm going for normal mode. I will probably just skip hard mode for now. There's the code. I know we've got at least one person in the game who is going to play, because Hysteria will probably join us. But we'll see, we'll see. And according to them, we should just go for random colors. Especially at the start, I think it doesn't really matter. I'm on my way. Perfect. You got like three minutes. It's no, no big deal. I just want to see if the normal reward is good. I will probably try to get a bunch of people together to do hard mode. I don't know, maybe the hard mode reward is like a shiny Pokemon or something. It's another shiny Haxorus! I never got uh, the the free shiny Haxorus. I ought to go do that. That one back in Gen 5. I ought to go get one of those, but I never did. I do like Haxorus. I totally forgot to connect to the interwebs. Yeah, I forget that all the time because I think... I should look to see if it'll automatically do it for me because I almost always just play it with the Switch in docked mode with an Ethernet connection to my router. So, like... Probably able to do it normally. Okay, I haven't seen anybody else say anything in chat, so we're just gonna start ousting. We're gonna oust the ogres. Okay, so my assumption would be then, Hysteria, that at the end of it, one of us should stay back at the, the berries... And the other person should go doing it, so that the first person can just be spamming R. You might get some people. Yeah, I, maybe if I ever want to figure out what the uh, the actual reward is. Yeah, probably guard. Okay, so once we get to the end, I'll I'll just I'll start guarding. Okay, I'll let you do the thing because you've probably done it more. But for right now, I'm sure we can just grab whatever. Hey, thank you for the follow. I can't see your name yet, so I don't know who you are. Okay, hopefully you have some grays, because I've got literally everything else. I don't see where you are, but I'm just hoping. Don't have any more, so I'm just guarding until you get back. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Moving on to the next one. I'll stand over here. I don't expect you to message, because obviously that's going to be kind of difficult with all this. 
I'm just gonna stand here and I'm gonna go this way. And yeah, once I make my first trip, I'll just stay back for... everything else. Oh, I need green? Gray? Whatever. I'll call that good. Hopefully we both have enough to just finish everything else off. Go to green! Get him! Let's go! The universal language of true singing Pokemon. Spin. <laughs> Just spin around like a nutcase. Okay, so yes, I will do one... I'll do one wrap around here, and then I'll just guard. Because I bet I can get like one or two fully done and like one or two most of the way. But of course I won't go back until I've got my very thing full. Which there it is. So I will stay back and guard. That's all you got left. I'm just spinning in circles looking for the angry boys. Nice! Back onto it. I'll make sure that we uh, stay in separate spots this time, because I kind of tranched on your territory there. Oh, that's not too many more. <laughs> yeah. It's obviously going to be best if we just stay away from each other, because then we don't steal each other's balloons or anything. Got a lot of, a lot of. I'll stay here, go grab the rest. Get some grays. Get the hell out of here. There are so many, oh my god. Nope, I got close with that one, but that's fine. Yes, as long as we have this whole system, we don't have to worry about anything. Nice! Alright, onwards again. Yes, spin, 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 spin. Obviously, spin, spin, spin. Alright, I'll do the same deal this time. Actually, it looks like I've got a lot of reds and greens. So I will fill up my thing with just reds and greens. I want to see if maybe I'm right. My cubes are getting to me. Oh, I immediately did not do that. Okay, whatever. I'm sure with four players on hard, it gets to the point where you're just like, No, 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 everybody get one color, please. Because otherwise we are wasting time. We probably don't have enough time to be able to have me just sit around and do nothing other than guard, so... Because we're just going back and forth, I won't sit around and do nothing. I will come back quickly, though. I'll probably only fill up my berry basket, like, halfway. Because there's a bunch sitting here, and I just gotta run through them all. And I'll just get a bunch of greens, and then head right back. Perfect. We should be good to get a bunch of these filled back up after the small amount that they get.
tell me you have the rest. Couple of greens, go get them. I'll stay. This is tough. Legitimately, this is kind of scary. No, you're on your way. Okay, there's probably one more, isn't there? Oh god. Okay. Oh my goodness, that's so many berries! Okay, last round. So yeah, there's no way that we're gonna be able to get this if I don't go run around and do a second wave. So I'm not just gonna sit around. Maybe with four people you could just have one person stay back, but not with two. I'll make sure that I don't have to do the jump again. Oh, fuck, what the hell is the Snorlax doing? Luckily, I was going right next to it, so I was able to just spook it away, but that's terrifying. He could probably eat fucking everything, couldn't he? I would probably need green. So I'm gonna go back, even though I didn't fill it up all the way, I think it's gonna be worth it if I just go back and stop the Munchlax from getting anything. I think you might have time to get those. I'm looking around the, the place. I can go across and get some blues. There are some available. Okay, I'll go back, you go get the four. That's all we need, just reds. You got it, you got time. I've got some spares to top off everything else if I fuck up. <gasps> You're coming! Let's go! Spin, 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 spin! Yeah! Thank you very much, Hysteria. You made it so that I could not care. <laughs> Oh, that's a. I'm taking a photo of that. That's great. <laughs> nice. View rewards. I got a fresh start and an Enigma berry. Those are my favorites. I think they're cute and funny. There's no way to do hard mode without four people. Okay, then I'm just gonna stop for the day. Maybe eventually I'll do them. Also, I thought we never had to deal with the Mickleberry again. I am just gonna stop playing. Because I want to see what the rewards are, and then I'll come back and do this one after hunting down some more Fury Falls idiots. Because I want to see what else we got. But that was cute. That's a good photo. I like your little character, Hysteria. The team has been disbanded. <gasps> Yeah, I'll probably do hard mode stuff at the end with other people. When I get, like, fairy feather. What? Item to be held by a Pokemon. This feather, which gleams faintly when hit by light, boosts the power of the holder's fairy type moves. They finally made one. Oh my god. Fucking finally. That took three generations and three DLC. Fairy charcoal. Yeah, it's just a boosting item, but I'm- oh, fuck, dude, I'm so happy that they finally made one. Do you understand how powerful the day was when Pokemon Home released? Because it made every fairy type a better chance at doing it because the pixie plate was the only thing that we had. Yes, you're so right. Oh my god. Fucking god. The pixie plate was the only thing. It took so long. All right, so they're somewhere on Blasiato Mountain. Maybe they are nearby Montanavera. It would make sense that they would like lodge there. I can have a pixie plate and a fairy wing. You can. My motto team is fairy. Good. My motto team is always dark, so I can have the pooch on it. That's it. Otherwise, it would be fucking anything else. 
because I get my ass beat all the time if I'm ever on showdown using a mono dark team. I show up against mono fire and it's just like, oh, but we have a firefighting starter, so you're dead. And then I show up against water types and they're like, oh, but we have quark waffle now, so I'm just dead. And then I show up against fairy teams and they're just like, oh, I have the entire team to kill you. I have a lot of struggles. I was telling someone about my Sylveon build for competitive and they said it was mean. I believe it. Sylveon can do very many things. Being mean is one of the easiest. If it's just pixelate hyper voice, that's probably it. It's probably all you need and you'll just destroy everybody. Oh, I can get some sandwiches. This guy will see my single Urba that I have. Yes, so I have the bitter ones now. I can use that. But I need to get other Urbas first. Pixelate, Calm Mind, Draining Kiss, Hyper Voice, and Last Resort. I would say Last Resort is probably not what you need on a team. I know Sylveon doesn't have too many coverage moves, but you could probably get away with a lot. Uh, does this guy give me a free thing? I think this might be our first time meeting. It is not. I have a shitload of bottle caps, though. I wonder where these rich idiots are. It's nice for things that are specially, specially defensive bulky. I mean, yeah, otherwise you're just spamming... <laughs> otherwise you're just spamming exclusively play rough on physical attackers and hoping you don't miss. I don't see the rich idiots around here. Maybe they went to one of the water spots around here? They could have gone here. They might have done that because... Fuck it. I don't know. I'm sure there could be a reason. The other person said they liked waterfalls. Onair was her name. She said she liked waterfalls when she said Why the fuck is a Clodzire able to even live here? It should just be dead. Like, instantly. It's so cold. <laughs> that ice type would just annihilate it. Ugh, maybe I should just Google it. I suppose I don't care. I don't need to experience any more of it. Glaziato Mountain's really fucking big. Uh, Billy and Onair. Locations. You will first encounter them in the Apple Hills, then the Fury Falls, then uh, that location, Apple Hills 2, Casaroya, Glaziado, and then somewhere in the fucking Great Crater. Oh, on the outskirts of the Great Crater. I was gonna be like, what? That's nuts, actually. The exact spot is weird. It's like up here. I'm sure if I just jumped down, I'd see him, but it's kind of nuts. And it looks like the Great Crater of Paldea is the last one. Looking down at the centermost point of Paldea. And it's right above South Province Area 3, so I'm chill with that. So, yeah, somewhere along this way, we'll find it eventually. I'm very excited for the Indigo Disc, because apparently we'll be able to, like, actually fly. <laughs> By unlocking some latent powers within our Winged King. Versus the Iron Serpent that uh, Hysteria will be able to have. Those are the paradox names for Koraidon and Miraidon, if you're curious. They say so in the books. They say Winged King and Iron Serpent. I can't wait. Yeah, I'm excited too. 
Whenever they drop, I'll be doing another one of those, like, day-long playthrough things, so... You'll be able to see it. If you want to play it, if, like, if you want to just see it happen day one. Whenever I get a release date, I'll uh, mark the time off. Uh, although, not to... Not to pray ahead of when I should be, you know, prepping for, but... I do have an interview later this month at a place that's going to give me a much better gig. It's more hours, so I would be having to stream less, but it would get me the opportunity. It's an opportunity that I really need for where I want to go. So I might be able to get a new job later this month, and I'm so excited to be able to get it. I'm so hopeful. Look how thin the material on our thing is. Do commoners have an easier time? <laughs> no, uh, we just handle it better because I don't have your money. Erudite? Fuck off. I appreciate that they think their mission is to be kind to the co the poor. It's a load of hogwash. Sure. Your aphorisms. Shut up. But let's make a request to the League just in case. They're not gonna let you in. I had to sneak in. Like, I had, I had to get one of the, like, most prolific hackers of our generation, one of the best cooks of our generation, and a champion rank trainer, all together, and we barely stood a chance against anything inside of there. Lore-wise, that's, like, the truth. Technically, I was doing fine, because this was a Nuzlocke playthrough, and... Well, I did win. It was fun, though. I did enjoy just kind of, like, prepping a lot of cool things. Okay. Rock slide. Oh, no. Yeah, I think we have to, like, get on top of this thing. Yes. Somewhere on the top, somewhere around here is the people. Oh god, I totally forgot Magnazone was even in this game. Now I have the flashy Jinbai. That's good. Yeah, it was around here somewhere. Well, I might as well search for one last one. It could be further down into that hole. I do doubt it, but it's possible. Probably further back, but that's okay. Oh, Garchomp actually flying! That's a rare sight to see in video games. <laughs> oh, but it gets stuck on the little wall. I'm so sorry, buddy. I wonder what level it is. I'm actually curious now. Hey! I was gonna be like, can we fight? <laughs> okay. It's so terrifying, like 75. Well, mine isn't, but that's cool. It's dead now. <laughs> mine was only 57. Well, you had the you had the numbers right. Oh, that one's like only 75. Maybe it's because it's so close to the early areas of the game. But I saw it and I was like, oh, well, that's weird. Let's see how far down I can get into here without it fucking me over. You know, I wonder, can you see the gate? You can! You can see the gate! What the fuck? I can't believe I've never gone in here to actually check and to notice that. Okay, so if I'm having struggles, or if I'm struggling to stand here... Came up here when I first started Violet and it was like 75 and erect me. Oof. That's bad. That or I'm thinking of Pokemon Reborn. You're probably thinking of this game, because you probably had to jump back so far. Okay, so this should be the last thing, I think. She might ask for another fight, but it's probably just going to be with the Persian again. 
Or she'll have a Persian and a Lolan Persian. Well, yes. Half limits to a glitterati. Why, if it isn't that commoner? Yeah, I've been there. Rags to riches! <laughs> no choice but to duel. Sure, dude, whatever. Let's head back down. They probably have a much stronger team now. If I had to guess, anyways. So it's probably not just gonna be a Persian. Oh, excuse me. Oh, you only have two? Okay. Are you gonna terastalize? Is that what the gimmick's gonna be? You're gonna like terastalize ground or like grass, hoping that you could use grassy glide with Persian? I don't know. I don't see it. I don't see the strat. Why would you just have an Arbolova? Was it just to be able to get fake out damage? Cause that's not gonna work out great for you, buddy. That's actually that's gonna work poorly for you in reality. I guess it's just a rich person who's an idiot. 70k! Thank god I had the amulet coin on there. She's got an emote from the healer. Oh, I never talked to the healer behind the counter, so I'll go check that too. We're all just people. Wish I could crawl under a rock and hide. Couldn't literally crawl under a rock, of course, but you know what I mean. Oh, oh, no. Uh, should I say yes? I'm gonna say no. Not sure why I even asked. 25 pickers! Glitterati case? Oh, it's probably the phone case. Sure. Okay, so he's got an emote too. I was expecting it to just be an emote, but I don't know how many, but I think I've healed five times. Like five times. I've healed that, I've probably healed that many times in Mossway, but I was just gonna say, like, if I talked to the people behind the counter, like if I went around and talked to them, maybe I'd get it. Or maybe I already have it, I don't know. I've got the one from the Tandem House people. I've got the one from the, the few people up in the festival who are just like weirdly hidden. Okay. Sure, I mean, I, I, if you heal them up, I guess that's good. She gave it to me after I healed, okay. So I thought I'd ask. Oh, thank you. Upside down piece. So they also charge my tarot orb, which is great. Uh, thank you for that tip. Yeah, apparently I just needed to do one more. <laughs> That's great. I don't, uh, what else did I need? I got the rich idiots, a bunch of chipped poke, or a bunch of poke. I need a chipped pot. So I need to be able to find that. I need to do an item hunt. I need to start hunting down the other items. I need to hunt down the paradoxes. So I guess the rest of this will just be raids because I need a lot of herba if I want to do those hunts efficiently. 
So I guess let's just start doing raids. With all the EXP candy, I should be pretty well off to kill stuff. And uh, while we do it around here, I'll make sure we kill these things. Because I definitely need to get all of these done too. I should write down that I've got a lot of ogre ousting to do. I should do ogre ousting. Until, like, three masterpieces. And three counterfeits. And then I need Pokemon to hunt for. Pooch. And then we need a uh, Great Tusk. I don't remember all of them, so I'll go back and I'll look at the decks and I'll just do them in decks order because it's more fun that way. Ekans, will you switch? No. I think I can just probably kill you. And uh, I'll add to my list, fight all trainers. Because I do want to do that. I want to have like a 100%, 100% save file, you know what I mean? I want to have all the trainers fought. I want to have everybody just like reveling in my greatness. Also, I have this weird feeling that if you fight all of them in the Indigo Disc, we might have a reward. I don't know why I feel that way, but, like, it's just in my bones. I feel it, you know? Okay. Why do you have a little notification? What did I do in the Kitakami Pokedex that you don't like? Did I see a authentic Sinistra? Or an artisan Sinistra? Looks like I did. Oh, no. I did. I saw a masterpiece and an unremarkable counterfeit form. But I didn't see a Polchageist in those forms, so I guess I never had the chance to get it. And probably the same with Growlithe, because I can look at the details and they probably have a dex entry for the other ones. They don't. So we are looking at Great Tusk, Screamtail. Oh, you already typed it out in chat. Scream tail, brute bonnet, flutter mane, slither wing, uh, sandy sharks, and then roaring moon. You are correct. And I should look to see which, which thing I should see. Details. Because that's ground fighting. But there's another ground type, so we should go with fighting for you. I should use a fighting type sandwich for Great Tusk. And then Screamtail is fairy psychic. But it's not the only fairy type. But it is the only psychic type, so it should be psychic. That's the one I should use for that. Brut Bonnet, Grass, and Dark, I think, are the only ones. So it could probably be... I'm just going to say Dark. Because I'll hunt that one right after I get my pooch, then. Fluttermane should be ghost, obviously, because we can do the daytime trick. Slitherwing, bug fighting, it should be bug. Sandy shocks should be electric. And then roaring moon should probably be dark. Uh, well, we can just do dragon, actually. Okay, so I have a little thing. Daytime ghost glitch? Yes. I suppose if they're for you, Hysteria, if you're comfortable with me getting it that way, I will do it. But Dragon gives you Zwilus. That's fine. Dragon and Dark will do that. I'm fucked one way or the other, it seems. Uh, hey, five star. Change your Pokemon. Uh, yeah, you'll do fine. Uh, wait. 
There's a thing I didn't remember to do. I have a thing. I have... I have a thing. I have a thing I can do. What dark type is there? Um, I mean, we've got Brute Bonnet. That's a dark type. That's grass dark. Uh, Zvilus is grass and... Er, Zvilus is dragon dark. Roaring Moon is dragon dark. Uh, there's other dark types in there, like... None that I can think of off the top of my head. Oh, I'm out right. Yeah. It's weird, because Roaring Moon is like the bad type con- It's like that weird- Yeah. You get what I'm saying. Okay. So, what I haven't done yet- Forgot it was Dark 2. Okay, there you go. Oh, hey! There's something fun there. <laughs> uh, and then I think I gave you a Nontaro for the other one. Two more for the decks. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, and where's Raid Crew? Yes, we only get to add one or two to the Raid Crew, sadly. Kelly and Spencer. Those are the two we get to add to the Raid Crew. However, we do have a bunch of catch crews ready. All of those need to be leveled up to the rest of the times, because I want to have a full catch crew by the time I get to uh, the Indigo Disc. I want as many as possible. I forgot I had a shiny fucking one of those guys. Um, anyways. Eventually, I'll start playing around with leveling these guys up, and I'll get all my shinies to level 100. Eventually. Okay, but... I need to place some Pokemon. Okay, I gotta remember what order they go in. Hold on. Sarah, be depositable Pokemon in home. We can just look at this list and go wherever Pikachu is, because it's close to the top. Okay, so the order is World Cap is last. This Pikachu goes here. But technically, World Cap goes here, because it was not released until Gen 8. So it belongs to the Gen 8 decks. Fun stuff. Um, but yeah, we got uh, more and more that we do not... Do not need to worry about now. Mwahaha! I have Pokemon! Okay. Out of a thousand and seventeen Pokemon. We have one. I've got a bunch of forms that I need to get, which are the other parts of the fun stuff. I want a complete dex, if you will. But uh, Zero Aura is the one that I can get the Pokeball Magearna from. And I want that Pokeball Magearna. You better fucking believe it. Also, was Pokemon Home released for Gen 7 or Gen 8? I assume Gen 7. Pokemon Home release date. February 12th, 2020. Pokemon Sword release date. I think that was 19, yeah. Okay, so that's Gen 8. So I should actually... Pokeball Magearna is in the wrong spot inside of my living decks then. Because I have it placed, I think, in Gen 7. So I gotta make sure Pokeball Magearna gets moved. I don't have one yet, but like the spot for it. Because it technically belongs in the Gen 8 decks. Because it wasn't released until then. Anyways. We have a fairy type Conkeldur here. And I don't have anything too crazy to fight it with. So I think we'll just use Marco. I think, I think Marco is going to be fine with that.
Because we'll, uh, we'll use a bunch of metal sounds. A couple of flash cannons. A couple of nasty plots. The goal is to boost myself first and then reduce Conkelder's power. And hope that my teammates don't actually do too much to Conkelder here. Okay. They won't be able to do a crazy amount. That's good. We'll get a little bit of passive recovery with our Bolivar. That's great. We'll go ahead and nasty plot. Very little damage. That's exactly what we want. Oh, scary face like I could care. Oh yeah, you keep scary facing me. Don't you worry, I am not scared of you. Okay, from itself, yes. So this is when we switch to doing metal sounds, because the next thing it's going to do is break ours. Okay. I think what's going to have to happen is I'm going to have to take a, take a chance on it now. So I'll give it a shot. Ah, you motherfucker! I was trying my best to avoid that. I spent that whole time, and I got fucked. It's fine, we can still do the rest, but that's not good. Is it better to do myself or to fight Conkelder? I'm just gonna hit Conkelder with a bunch of stuff so that we can try to do helpful stuff with the rest of it. We'll see if I can do this. Hopefully it puts up its shield soon. Yes! Perfect. Exactly what we want. I want to look at you, and you have just a single special defense drop. I don't think I can metal sound it now. I'm pretty sure that's not going to actually allow me to do that. I could try, though. Yeah, we'll call this one a mulligan, because I could come back and do this better. Okay, yes, the Terra, the, the Terra does break it. Sounds good. If I fail this, that's fine. I, I, I did that almost on purpose. <laughs> My teammates are doing great, surprisingly. Like, I'm just trying to set up sweep, but... Hey, don't be doing that! <gasps> hey, do be doing that! Definitely be dropping your attack and defense. Ah, don't be doing that though. <laughs> you had a plan and I didn't realize you had a plan. That's not great. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can get away with it. Ooh, we might. Hey, we might just win. We're gonna be close, we'll, we'll see. Can you guys get away with a single attack? Okay, so it's gonna reduce its... It's gonna clear itself of negative effects. Can the rest of you get away with a single attack? No, but I can. We got real lucky there. I played poorly as hell. But, that's cool. I don't need a Conkholder because I have Spencer. Who is named... For funny reasons. Uh... <laughs> I do not need to catch you. I do not like the carny looking ass you got. Oh, spicy herba! Hey! That's great! And of course I get the, the bonus fairy terra shards at the end because I have the decks completed. So that's one more herba down. I need a lot more. Uh, I need a, a shitload more before I really want to go hunting for stuff. But, you know. You know. If I can get... I have two. I don't remember the any two recipes, but there used to be a recipe guide out there that using any two Herba Mystica, you could get yourself a thing. You could get yourself a sandwich of the right type. 
But now most people say, use the different ones. Okay, well, this is gonna be easy, because it's just that. Hammer arm, I, fuck dude, I, hold on. I gotta make sure that Spencer is like, properly functioning. I need him, he's gonna be very useful to me. So I'm gonna have to put him into the party and make sure we got everything done for him. I don't really need to have the rest of you guys. But all of you need to be leveled up to level 100 before I get to the Indigo Disc. That is the goal. And that is multiple hundreds of thousands of EXP points. It's posted. Perfect. Mwahaha! Because now I have two, I could go hunting for the dog. <gasps> Can mix and match. Yes! Because I know the, the really fun ones are the, the easy ones. Check summary. There are like three moves I want you to have. Do you get coaching? Not by a level up, which kind of sucks, but okay. <laughs> uh, low kick. No, that's not going to help. Rock slide. Forget a move. I'll never use focus punch. You do get stone edge. Use TMs to learn moves. You should learn close combat. Um, generally speaking, I advise on using Drain Punch in raids. Let's teach it Terra Blast. Actually, over Hammer Arm. And then the last thing should probably be Train Punch, but uh, I'm going to make it bulk up because I'm funny. Let's go ahead and reorder these moves. And then its ability is Guts, which means... It's somewhere in here. I have a lot of them. Okay, there we go. Because, <laughs> yes, its ability is Guts. You don't have a ribbon. Okay, well, we're going to get you a ribbon. Because there is a specific one I would love to have on you. Because it would make so much sense. Uh, anyways, we should be able to just KO this pretty quick with a uh, bulk up or two. And then just go off. There is a specific uh, ribbon that got unlocked. In, in this DLC, we got a fun ribbon. Uh, it's called the Item Finder Ribbon, or the Item Finder Mark, or something. And you can get it. You can you can put it onto your Pokemon, just by having them pick up items. So I'm going to do that, because I really want that. I think it would be fun, anyways. It got unlocked in this, this one. I was waiting for it to get unlocked. Okay, bulk up. How much damage do you all do? Spencer rises his attack and defense. I am burned. Perfect. I am very glad that I got the bulk up off first. <laughs> Close combat. I love Guts so much. Guts is so much fun. Okay. So the question is, do I want to do the shiny hunt right away? And I think the answer is yes. Welcome back, Lizzie. I think we're gonna... I think we're gonna go hunt for my, my baby little pooch. Because I, I want that fucking dog so bad. <laughs> Let's do it. I am excited. But, first of all, <laughs> I do need to do the... It's got a, it's got a 1 in 100 chance to be put onto your Pokémon whenever it picks up an item. So if you do a few... Okay, it doesn't want to pick up this item. That's fine. 
How would I get Herba Mystica? I just finished my decks. Uh, it seems that just grinding out the level 5 raids are the best way to do it. I've only gotten two, and I've been playing this game for like 100 hours. And both of them have been gotten during this DLC. I did not get them in any other way. Would you pick up those items, please? Nice. Alright, the question is, do you have the item finder mark yet? No. Wait, what the fuck was that? Was that a full beat? Oh, it was a cricket tot. <laughs> it's like, what the hell are you? Yeah, Herba Mystica is just a grind. There is nothing good about it. It is just real rare drops. There are charts that give you bonus Herba Mystica. Um, like, there are certain Pokemon that in 5 and 6 star raids will give you bonus ones. But those aren't even guaranteed drops when they do happen. So, like, you're always going to just be having to grind. If you have a shiny hunt in mind, you should be grinding for them. Because it really does increase your odds insanely well. But otherwise, eh, there's, there's good reason to have it. There's good reason to ignore it. Do you have it yet? No. I know another good spot that's got a lot of items is right in the front of the town. I just want to get it on one of my Pokemon. But uh, there's a shitload of items right in front of the town. There's a shitload of items everywhere, in all honesty. on these little rice patties? Are they called patties? Paddocks? There's usually a lot of items. But I'm not actually seeing very many, so maybe I'm wrong. There's one. Hi, little pooch. My little baby, I love you. Oh, <gasps> Wooper! You know what? We'll kill two birds with one stone. Oh, I... God damn it. Can I set up a picnic while I have a Pokemon out? I can. Okay, we'll make this sandwich. I should have all the ingredients. What do you want to do? I want to... Actually, I need to pack up and go. Because I don't have the right Pokemon in my party yet. Because I am going to desperately need my catch crew for a lot of this. There's Loxton, there's Shadrach, there's Eggnog, and there's Quinn. Now, Swiper and Bunt are two very different Pokemon. Oh, right. Swiper was actually going to become... Because it's pure rock type. Or its terra type is rock. I think I was going to have that become a fighter. And I don't need Golduck on the thing yet. Golduck is used for soak. If you're curious. That's its whole purpose. Anyways, remember some moves, please. You got... Absorb, Leech Seed, Poison Powder... I would like you to also have Stun Spore, please. And you can get rid of Seed Bone. Go ahead and put False Swipe there, and you two there. So yes, all of you should have False Swipe. That is correct. And you, I will make sure you've also got Stun Spore. And of course, all of these would just generally have... Hold on. Change position. 
change position. Check summary. So yes, Swords Dance would be one of them. Aqua Cutter, Draining Kiss, Hypnosis, Thunder Wave, Double Team, Calm Mind, Leaf Blade, Charm, Future Sight, Imprison. Usually I have them do a bunch of random stuff, but now I can't do that as well. Oh, there he is. Heal Pulse. Okay. So it looks like all of you guys will probably have that exact moveset. False Swipe, Thunder Wave, Heal Pulse, Sword, sword Stance. Because that is the one I need that's not specialized. So, hey. That's about it. Heal Pulse over Encore. Heal Pulse, Swords Dance over fucking anything, who cares? False swipe over wide guard, who cares? And then the last one is Thunder Wave. It's in here somewhere, I'm sure of it. It's not. <laughs> I wonder when you learn it. Well, Eggnog, you know what? Now's the time. Fuck, you didn't even level up. <laughs> you barely leveled up at all. You didn't even get the fucking... God damn it. It didn't even get the the thing I needed it to have. I guess it doesn't really matter. Unless I've got it. I'll put it on. Okay, yeah, there we go. I was just like, what the hell? That's kind of nuts. I can't believe you don't have that yet. Because, <laughs> yeah, usually I would have, like, ring targets. And I would have one with trick, one with imprison, one with throat chop, one with a bunch of different moves. That do a lot to just help us prevent people from fighting. In particular... What should I have you all carrying? Not a rocky helmet. Usually a defensive item is good. Leftovers. I could always give you like four leftovers. Or just a bunch of silk scarves, but I don't have any silk scarves yet. I think we'll be just fine. If I have to be completely honest with you. Actually, I'll make Loxton the lead. I think that's best. Alright, let's go ahead and heal. Picnic, please. Go ahead and make a sandwich. We're supposed to do this in creative mode. A tomato, an onion, a green pepper, and a hamburger. Two smoked fillets. And two random Herba Mystica. And that should... I can just quit out, don't worry. That should give us... Everything exactly how we wanted it. So yeah, tomatoes would be next, because you guys are the biggest thing. I'm going to pray that we don't need the top button. Because now it's frozen. Sometimes you don't need the top button. I don't... Obviously, this looks terrible. <laughs> Do not make this sandwich. Don't... Don't say that it's good. It's not. It's not good. Don't make that. That would be bad. 
Three stars, sparkling title, and encounter power dark. Level three. Let's see. Basically, everything should be pooch now. There's a pooch. Pooch, 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 pooch. Love the dog. I'm so scared about missing it, though, because the grass is so much taller here. So I have the shiny charm and the sparkling power. Does anybody happen to know what the uh, what the odds are at this high of a rate? Because I actually don't. I gotta remember that as soon as I get my dog, I have to go straight to. I have to go straight to the Great Crater. Because I want to immediately keep using this to try to get a Roaring Moon, a Brute Bonnet, and others. I'm trying to go as slow as possible because I want to make sure I don't miss the dog. I'm so scared because it doesn't make a noise. I'm hopeful that we get an item eventually that makes the noise when it spawns. don't want any items sparkling on the ground. I would really prefer to not have that. Because I'm looking for a gold dog. And the sparkly things are gold. Come on, little pooch. You just gotta spawn for me. Oh, I gotta make sure I turn off uh, autosave. Because if I don't turn that off, it means that I might lose my Herba Mystica. I might have already lost it, but I don't know for sure. I usually don't count my encounters. So I won't be doing that this time. Are we able to save uh, in front of shinies in this game? Does anybody know? Even if you have a sandwich power? My guess would be no. Because you could save in Legends Arceus, and that would be fine. I've seen people save in this game. Oh, wait, no. I know for a fact that you can. Because we have... I have... I have... A mental image of Absol Blog's Pokemon finding his uh, three-segmented Unsparse. And they saved. So that they could warp back. And get it in a Master Ball. One of these pooch. Today's the day. I know that you can use like too salty or too sweet Herba Mystica for the other old sand or for the newer sandwich styles. And it just saves you ingredients, but oftentimes I don't think you need to save ingredients. <laughs> How the hell 
that I get an Urban Mystica to spawn. Also, thank you, uh, Kaolpi for the follow. That was like an hour ago and I missed it. I think I said thank you for the follow, but I didn't say your name. and That's usually the thing people want. <laughs> so I try to do that. For me, I just want to, whenever I like do that to other streamers, I just want to see them fluster to try to like pronounce my name. Because I think it's fun. How long have we been going for? About six minutes. Oh! Oh, I thought it crashed for a second there. I was gonna be like, whoa, let's go! Because it's I, that would be my second crash of the game. I've had it crash once, but not two times yet. Despite the lag I often experience with this game, it's remarkably stable. I love their little grunts. They're so cute. Come on. Some poaches. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I only really want one for now. I can always hunt for more later. Also, right now I'm procrastinating homework. And I feel bad about it. God, there's something in my eyes. I have been on the verge of crying like all stream. I do not know why. Maybe it's that smoke smell that I smelled earlier. Because it's like my neighbors are grilling. At an ungodly hour, let's be clear. Like, it's 11 p.m. where I am. Why the fuck? I mean... Okay, so maybe they work... I don't actually know where these neighbors, like, work. But they might work across the time zone border, because we're close to that. So for them, in their head, it might only be like 10 p.m. We're only like a 40-minute drive from the actual time zone no difference. Ugh. So maybe I shouldn't be so mean about it is what I'm saying. God damn! Do we just not? Am I stupid? I know I have the shiny charm on this file. I feel as though like my luck is usually not as bad as this. It's pretty bad. I have pretty bad shiny luck. Generally speaking, I have terrible shiny luck. But of course, I'm much more worried about it now because, you know, they don't make a sound. If I heard them make a sound, I'd be way more confident because I know that, like, when I hear them, I can hit save and I can go collect them. This sandwich might be the last thing I do tonight. On stream. I'll probably be 
playing for another 20 minutes or so off stream, but that's just how it goes. Come on, you know what I'm here for. I finished so much of the story to try to get a better, like, shiny charm or herba charm. And I didn't get one. I got a fucking Terra Jewel charm, which I think is the funniest and worst thing they could have given me. Of all the things in the world that you didn't necessarily need more of, it was probably Terra Jewels. Because the Terra Jewels, you can already increase your bets of by getting a sandwich power. And most people only ever need specific Terra Crystals at a time. Like, say you need to switch a Berserker to Fairy, you'll be like, okay, well, I'll only go fight Fairy Terra Raids for the next couple of minutes. And you could just make a Fairy Terra Raid boost item power sandwich thing. I don't know what they're actually called. I think it's item power. Come on, pooches. Counting on you. Give me a shine. Shine bright like a diamond. Please? Anybody? Anybody want to be shiny? Yeah, I might have already lost these Urba due to me not turning off autosave before I built the sandwich. But if that's the case, I'm okay with that because that teaches me a valuable lesson to never forget that again. But I'd be a little annoyed with myself. Although, it, it, it'll probably take me a bit to get a, another couple of Urba. I could probably do it. I need to be working on my Halloween costume now, too. I'm sure I can just buy it from a cosplay shop, but I don't know. I might have to do it myself, because I don't know what I want to cosplay. I just know I want it to be a magma or an aqua front with my little pooch hat. Oh my god, was that Square Sparkles? No fucking way, that was Square Sparkles. You know what I didn't check? I didn't check what uh, moves it would have, and it's gonna memento me right now. Okay, well it's got fucking takedown. Great. Okay. Uh, in that case... But we're not doing anything other than just throwing Pokeballs, because it's going to kill itself. Uh, level up. Move set. Learn set by leveling up in Gen 9. It's got Yawn, Takedown, Sucker Punch, and Play Rough. All of those are fine. Takedown I'm nervous about, but I have Heal Pulse for good reason. So pretty! I love her! Yes, she's luckily not taking too much recoil damage because I have a good trained Gallade here. <gasps> Crit cap! Hey! I got it! I got the little dog! Let's go! She's so adorable! I love her! Oh my goodness! I love her! Look at her! Oh! Would you like to give her a nickname? Absolutely! What is her nickname? She is... Uh... Should I just say Glamour? I kind of like Glamour. Okay, I gotta check. I have to check now. 
Did we get a mark? We did not. So that is an unmarked shiny, which sucks, but it's okay. So we're gonna fly to the zero gate. And I think I just saw something with Team Star get popped up on my map, but it's fine one way or the other. Let's see how much time I've got on the sandwich to try to get some Roaring Moon, Brute Bonnet, etc. 15 minutes. So that is a that is a decent amount of time to get that pooch. I like that. <laughs> oh, I should also definitely save now because I got the damn dog. We are going to go to number three. Because right outside of it is a huge space for Brute Bonnet. And if we catch a Brute Bonnet and we still have a bit of time left on the sandwich, we can go straight to getting a Roaring Moon. Maybe. We'll see. We know where the little room is. It's tucked away in a corner right by us, but... For what we've got, we just need to find... A shiny brute. Also, if anybody's in chat, you better shout at me if I miss one. looking as close as I can at all of them. That's a tiny one! That's adorable. Hopefully, we'll be able to find a shiny one. So I think that would be really cool. But yes, I will not be hunting for these off stream if you're curious. Just because I want to make sure Hysteria has proof that they are legitimate. It tends to be a big thing inside of the Pokemon community that you want to make sure you've got legitimate Pokemon. I think that's reasonable. So, uh, I'll be doing the hunts on stream and the grinding off stream. That's the goal, anyways. I am totally okay if we do not get this shiny. Cause this was an addendums hunt. Like this was the this was the next thing to find. Cause I wanted to do them in dex order, but this just lines up. somebody outside of my fucking window. Don't know how they'd be there, but... It's fine. Bonnet, 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 bonnet. No, I should actually check inside of here to see if there is any brute bonnet spawns in here.
There don't seem to be. Yeah, that's why I would use a dragon type sandwich in here. Because I don't seem to be getting very many spawns. So I would want to make sure that my encounter power is suited to whatever's got the least, you know, the, the smallest amount of chance to spawn. Oh, and I just realized I used my spicy Herba Mystica before actually showing it to Sandwich Guy. I'll make sure I don't make that mistake again. Hopefully I get one of each five before tomorrow's stream. I'm, As I said, I'm technically procrastinating some homework, so... In the morning, I'll just be doing that when I wake up, because I don't... I don't want to get snuck up on. Even though I'm already snuck up on. Technically, there's no due date for this homework. But if I don't do it... I'll probably fail the exam. So, I should probably fucking do the homework. I am paying for it, after all. I'm the one paying for the fucking college, so... It'll be worth it. I know it will be worth it in the end. So I'm working my ass off. In hobby projects like Pokemon and streaming in real projects, like schooling and getting a new job. And I just realized how fucking hectic my life currently is. <laughs> Man, I've got a lot going on. But I'm juggling it just fine because I don't really do anything else. Like, it's this relaxing homework and other stuff, you know? But, uh... You know, I think I could design in Photoshop a better shiny for Brute Bonnet. But I would make it... Like, obviously because it's Pokeball based, like that's its design gimmick. I would make the uh, the shiny Cherish Ball based. So I would turn the whole thing into Cherish Ball. And also have the little hanging little fungi be red and black. Because I think that would be dope as hell, you know? I'm going through encounter after encounter right now. Again, I am happy with what I got today, whether or not I have this one for trading away. Because this is not my shiny. This is going to be Hysteria's, because they said that they would be able to trade over a bunch of rare Pokemon. But of course, they wanted an exchange for stuff, which is reasonable. Come on, buddies. Give me a shiny so I can start hunting uh, Roaring Moon immediately. Shiny, shiny, shiny. Give me a shiny. time on the sandwich. I'm getting a little nervous. A little worried. But I might not see it. But that's okay. That's totally fine. Hey, get out of here. I can't believe I just got it. Um, hey, uh, Hysteria, is there any chance that you're in chat right now? If you are, uh, you should let me know if you have any issues with uh, Pokeballs. 
because I would like to throw a quick ball at this. But if you don't want it in a quick ball, and you'd rather have it in something just at least like an ultra ball or something normal, you should tell me like now. I can actually check to see if they're in chat. Hold on, let me refresh. Users in chat. Is Hysteria here? Looks like Hysteria is not here, so I am throwing the quick ball because I don't care. We might not have gotten it. We didn't! Okay, so I'll actually have to catch a catch it. Clear smog is fine. Okay, you've got clear smog. I'm gonna try to knock you down about half health, if that's possible. You've got thrash. I'm trying to knock you down about half health. Eh, one more to do it. Oh, okay, never mind. We're not going to do another one. Ultras. Oh, nice, we got it. Okay. Into the den of, uh, of Roaring Moon. Hey, that's two shinies in one stream, and it wasn't even Legends Arceus. That's kind of insane. Give it a nickname? Absolutely. Its nickname is... Um... Uh, Grumble Shroom. Grumble Shrew. Uh, Grumble Mush. Because that fits. Okay. How much longer do we have? About four minutes. Let's schmooze. There's still a chance that we could use this power to get a roaring moon, and then I would consider myself the luckiest motherfucker on the planet. And uh, if that's the case, as the luckiest motherfucker on the planet, I will ask for all of your mother's phone numbers. <laughs> okay. Come on, guys. Give me the big boy. Show me at least one. I just want to see at least one. I don't like that we see a lot of palmy. Yeah, there's not... <gasps> okay, so we know that they can spawn here, but that was not the shiny. That's good. Can we not with this dumb delayed camera? Can we just have it locked to the player, please? Because what I'm experiencing is the worst thing I've ever experienced, actually. Okay, there's another one, but that's not shiny. My shiny teeth and me. Hopefully we'll find something. If we don't, I am okay. It'll be fine. But I'm just hopeful. Since I don't give a damn about these shinies. I just hope that I get them over with quickly. Kinda mad that the, uh, the pooch took up half of the sandwich. I wish my luck was a little better than that. Well, there's another Roaring Moon, but it ain't shiny, sadly. We'll know the sandwich powers run out when we stop seeing the Pokemon that we keep seeing. Because we're seeing a lot of Houndstone groups spawn in. We'll probably see even more when I don't have the sandwich on. Oh! 
I think that might be our sign to stop, but we'll see. I want to see some fairy or psychic type. Then I will double check my thing again. Because I'm not seeing any changes yet. Okay, I see two Espeon and ones. We did see an Espeon before, though. Floatzel, Golduck. I think that might be it. It's not over yet. What the fuck? Oh my god. Uh, show me a shiny Sneasel. There's a Glimmant. I hadn't seen one of those yet. Okay. Yeah, that's that's probably it. It is. Okay. Anyways, let's check to see if Grumblemush has a mark. It does not. I'm very sorry. But we have Grumblemush, the Brute Bonnet. And we also have Glamour, the Poochina. Look at her. She's so cute. I love Poochina so fucking much. It's such a dumb thing. And you did not get a mark. I am kind of sad that you didn't get a mark. Maybe that'll be my, uh, maybe that'll be my golden goose of shiny hunting. A shiny Poochina of every mark. God. What a nightmare that would be, right? Okay. Well, I need to go to Kitakami and start doing more raids. But in order to do that, I'm gonna need some sleep. Because I've been up a while. Uh, and also, my head is fucking killing me. I've had a crazy headache all day. <laughs> Anyways. I will, uh, cross off. Sorry, hold on. I want to save. I will cross off Pooch. And Brute Bonnet off my list. Which means that the next time you see me, we'll be hunting Great Tusk. I'll make sure that I have a bunch of ingredients. So I'll make sure that I have a bunch of everything. Hopefully, as time goes on, I will get enough XP candies to just knock everything out of the water. Uh, what didn't I have? A Pachirisu fur. I did not have that. Oh, I should go sell those big nuggets so I can tell how much money I have. Because I should definitely be getting some extra Pokeballs before I go. Oh yeah. Okay. Those big nuggets were a good choice. Okay. Yep. I'll make sure that I can get most of my team up to level 100 here and maybe specialize them into something else. I can make uh, Quinn or Eggnog the trick setter so that we can get a ring target onto Flutterbane. I don't know if we need anything else specific, but um, Screamtail is going to be annoying because it's got the fairy stab. Fluttermane shouldn't be too bad because it's going to be really easy to do the reset for it. Luckily, we just need two, four, six, eight... 10, 12 more Herba Mystica, and I can get all of these done. I can get every single shiny hunt done, because I only have to expend two per shiny hunt. That's cool. Anyways, because uh, I can I can just, I can save scum to keep the thing if I don't get the shiny. So technically, for every single, you know, shiny we get, we we're only expending two Herba Mystica. Uh, but that's, like, the maximum. Anyways, that'll be it for me. I should really upload my VODs and title them so that you guys can actually watch this stuff, but we'll see eventually. Okay, bye bye Sweet dreams, have a nice night, etc. <sighs>